Why is it that in his word, God appears sometimes to say the same thing over and over again? It's tempting, isn't it, to skip over bits of it as we think to ourselves, yeah, sure, I've read that before. Hi, I'm Bernie Diamond, and welcome again to Fresh. Over the course of this week, we've been stepping verse by verse through chapter 6 of the book of Romans, written by Paul the Apostle. And right from the get-go, he seems to say the same thing over and over again. If you believe in Jesus, you're dead to sin and alive to God. So what caused the Holy Spirit to inspire Paul to keep saying that over and over again? Well, sometimes I think that you and I can be a bit spiritually thick. Sorry to put it as bluntly as that, but it's true. For the death he, Jesus, died, he died to sin once and for all. But the life he lives, he lives to God. So you also must consider yourselves dead to sin and alive to God in Christ Jesus. Tempting though it may be to skip over this passage, let me ask you, in your life, are you truly dead to sin? Are you truly alive to God? Do you see? Sin lingers on by and large because we haven't allowed the Holy Spirit with the same resurrection power that raised Christ from the dead to fill our hearts with this life-changing truth that through your faith in Jesus, you are dead to sin. So when temptation comes knocking at your door, you can refuse to take delivery because by the power of the blood of Christ shed for you, you are dead to sin. That's God's Word fresh for you today. And the more you let the Word of God loose in your heart, the more that power will set you free. So don't forget that I'd love to send you your Fresh Devotional every day. It's completely free. Just stop by at freshdevotional.org and when you do subscribe, you'll immediately receive a copy of my ebook, How Can I Hear God Speak to Me? That web address again is Fresh devotional.org.